class, now we're working on section 2-3, similar triangles. Here's our example problem. If Adam was 15 feet tall and modern man is 6 feet tall, how long will it be before human beings disappear? First, draw a vertical line representing Adam's 15 foot height. Now draw a horizontal line representing the ground. Draw another vertical line representing the six foot height of modern man. Now draw a line from Adam's head through modern man's head and extending to the ground. This creates a triangle, the triangle of sin. It shows how mankind has paid the price for Adam and Eve's disobedience in the garden by shrinking year after year. Now identify the small triangle whose vertical is the six foot height of modern man. Label our diagram with our known data. Adam was 15 feet tall, modern man is six feet tall. Then we turn to biblical science and label the time from Adam to modern man as 6,000 years. Now call our unknown X, the number of years from now until mankind disappears. We have two similar triangles, the red triangle and the blue triangle. By the properties of similar triangles, we know that the total time from Adam until human beings disappear, which is 6,000 plus X, is to 15 as X is to 6. Now we have an algebra problem. 6,000 plus X over 15 is equal to X over 6. Cross multiply by 6 and 15 to clear fractions. Distribute the factor of 6 to get 36,000 plus 6x is equal to 15x. Now subtract 6x from both sides. To get 36,000 is equal to 9x. Finally, divide both sides by 9. To get 4,000 is equal to x. This tells us that in 4,000 years, Mankind will shrink to nothing. Now what can we do with this information? Well, let's say that it's another 2,000 years before Jesus returns. How tall will people be? Again, it's similar triangles. 2,000 is half of 4,000, so mankind's height will be half of 6 feet, or 3 feet. Now who can tell me why when Jesus first came to earth 2,000 years ago, he was 9 feet tall?